What is up everybody? This is Sugi Tech coming back from a very long hiatus, but now I'm here again with another new Sony Vegas guys and this time we're going to do a very simple trick. How to do a simple blur effect on your video. And I have a very simple clip here of a chessboard which is rotating all the time and we're going to create a simple blur effect on this video clip. So what we're going to do is go into the video track and click this button here which says event effects and this screen will appear will give you different types of you know effects we have looked down to some of those in the other videos but this time we're going to use sony gaussian blur and we're going to select that and click ok and voila we got a blur effect on the video as you can see and you can adjust this um, you can change the horizontal range vertical range you can exclude certain color colors of it and it will give you kind of interesting effects but for the most part people wanted to the blur effect and this can be used in a very very different types of styles so for example we can move this track here and have another picture which we can resize and optionally you can use a uh, text and this can appear on the screen while the background is blurred if you don't want to show copyrighted content this is how you can like you know produce stuff and um, another thing that people people obviously have is when they record with their phones to my understanding there is some type of a you know program that will you know fill these backgrounds so this is black and it will look once you put it on the YouTube it will look kind of bad right this is like grinded look bad so what you have to do is you copy this video footage taken on with your phone and you duplicate it and next you are going to we're gonna mute this for a second and we're gonna choose this here and this screen will appear event and pan crop and we will remove the maintain aspect ratio and we can blur it like this and obviously this this is a one way really one simple way to fill up the screen right now and you can adjust it and tweak it a lot but this is a one way to really fill the screen once you're doing stuff with your phone and I think this is a really really nice way to really fill the screen because if it's like full black unless you want to fill it with subscriber info and stuff like that it will look rather bad but this looks much better than the thing that we had a second ago right and that kind of concludes the blurring effect. Obviously, there are certain different methods that can, um, you know, be used. Um, the blurring technique is probably best when you have a background, which is perhaps copyrighted content, which you want to blur out in, you know, just a way of avoiding like uh, content ID strikes or, you know, it just looks better on the background. And, you know, this tool can be used in many, many different ways. And... Uh, Please check out my other guides on this channel. I have many other Vegas guides and obviously I'm going to do After Effects and Photoshop in uh, sometimes as well. Um, if you have any questions regarding the Gaussian Blur effect, please write a comment down below and I will help you out and answer it. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you guys next time. Cheers.